Hello, welcome back everybody. If you're watching on YouTube, thank you for watching. Welcome. Uh, Alright, we're continuing along here. We picked our party at the... just before the break there. <clears throat> I don't know if this party's going to work at all, but um, I mean, it's worth a try. At this point, it's like I said, I like kind of just mix and matching. You know, I don't want to end up... I don't want to get locked into taking the same party over and over again. Um, I really kind of want to take pistol shot though if he's in the third slot I mean open vein is good <clears throat> but what I don't know what we would get rid of because these are all pretty good it would have to be it's either I mean double tap does more damage we do have we do have the ability to hit the fourth rank here with the occultist <clears throat> if he's not busy healing um, I think we can try this for now. If, if we are really struggling, then we can just switch up the skills. So we're just going to march right on forward here. Through the valley. Onward. And let us hope enough yet remains of the hope world. Hope everyone's having a great night here. So far. How's everybody doing? It's Friday night here. We're... 11:30 p.m. Getting close to being Saturday morning. Um, what do we get? Bleed resist plus one speed. Who has the? You have terrible speed, so we'll just give you both of these. <clears throat> Clotting powders. Glimmer of hope. All right, looks good. It's a mediocre first haul. Interminable faculty mixers became something of a delight, knowing we'd abscond to a quiet table and lose ourselves in riveting discussion and claim our flame. Debate. We get a little cheese for our efforts. You can feel it. Coming in, in the air tonight. So I hope the audio in the game is loud enough that that makes sense when I do that. <laughs> you see, even your valley is not immune. Even your to precious valley. Thing. Nice, good. Slow Off to a great start here with the crit. An I'll take end. it. Ooh, I like that. Okay, that does a lot of damage. Wow. What she got? What, this, that's got it. Oh, wow. We have two characters with that. Holy crap, that's insane. I should really pay more attention to that stuff. On to the next. They get the super dodge to start. I like that a lot. That's gonna that's gonna be our winner right there. Wow, he punched through the 75% miss chance. You gotta respect it. You do the double tap again? Yeah, let's just let's just bleed him. Oh, I forgot to mess with his skills. No wonder. All right. He's dead anyway. All right. I messed with everybody else's skills. How did I miss him? Are you shaken? There is so much worse in store. All right. So let's. So again, we'll take off the Sacrificial Stab, put on the Binding Shadows. Um, which makes me think we should put the Duelist Advance on. Because, yeah, I think we, we, we absolutely need to do that. Um, I want to keep the Tracking Shot on. I don't really want to take off Take Aim. But tracking shot is like far too necessary. All right, so we'll try that for now then. Got some neutralizing powders. Good, good, good. Oh, we got a trinket too. Sure, why not? You were the one. 
you had the screen up at the time, so you get it. Uh, we'll take off the weakening curse and put on the vulnerability hex, which means maybe we don't need the tracking shot, actually. Because the vulner vulnerability hex will also do the same thing. So let's take that off, and do we keep take aim or do we do a pistol shot? Let's do the pistol shot. Yeah, we'll see how that works. Because we've got the duelist advance, and we can upgrade that. That'll give him some dodge, too. <clears throat> All right. I feel a little better about that. Made it to the first in with no stress. That's a good sign. We would come here in summers of years gone to ride. So no need to heal and rest. No need to. Do we have any party affinity items? Increase maximum HP. Hmm. Mm, improves affinity slightly. Increase speed until next in. Those are all very good. What's this? A large heal? Oh, it's a combat item. Oh, wow. Yeah, let's buy it. We'll buy it. Uh, we will also buy the stew. And I think that's going to be it. To Adrenaline tonic is good, but I don't really want to tempt fate with that one. Alright, so who gets the stew? Who needs the, uh, I think, uh, we should probably give it to Bonnie. And we'll give it to Alhazred. Then we'll feed them. Use it up. Use it all up. Uh, triage kit. That's all you, buddy. All right, Listen. so then practice improve. Heals 33%. That's pretty good. Um, steal two positive tokens. That's great. Uh, that, that's very good stuff. Um, double tap. What's this do? Ooh, deal plus 30% damage when target is below 50 HP, or 50% HP. Take aim is good, tracking shot good. Duelist advance, I kind of want to want to add that for the extra repost and the dodge. This is a, uh, let's actually, let's start with, let's do the weird reconstruction, because <clears throat> the difference between 2 and 3 bleed is a big deal. Your coach must be maintained. We'll upgrade some inventory slots. You you must go. What's this? Uh, ooh, yeah. Who wants the stun resist? Let's give it to the healer. The healer. Everywhere in ruin. Everywhere in need. Uh, I don't really care about these rewards. We have... I don't really want to go to the sprawl. But the Fodor's been kicking our butts. Let's try it. Let's, let's go. I mean, Bonnie won't be of tremendous use there. Behold the great mm. cities of man. Ruined and a flame. All right, plus forty stun resist. That's pretty great. Consider all variables. Uh, they all want to go. Quickly. Looks like the group consensus is to go straight ahead here. It's an academic study. I haven't really seen too much reason to interact Damage with the academic the study. Like, if I can help it. Of indistinct ideas. Oh, it's a portrait of, of, of uh, our wonderful ancestor. Uh, 
Um, either way, these guys' relationship sucks. We got good torch, so let's try it. Let's, let's, uh... An inkling of potency what do we get? Lingers in some of these well -worn Plus 15 relics. horror resist? Sure. I'll tell you what, we'll even give it to him since he's the one that had to have it. And he's now a tippler. Is the flickering torch you bear. All right, where are we going? Nobody has an opinion. Let's go for the. Let's go for the fight. Famous last words. You will fight, so that others. May flee. Maybe not the best decision after lo voluntarily lowering our flame, but it is low indeed to profit in destruction. It's okay. This is a pretty, pretty easy road battle, and we can actually increase our flame here. So let's do it. Let's just keep it up. Um. Now nah, we're gonna smoke screen this punk in the back here. Um. Yeah. All right. Cool. We'll advance. Sick dodge, bro. Nice. Very good. Not, not a whole heck of a lot of need to do anything other than just like smash a dude right now. So we will in fact smash a dude. Perfect. I want to see how much damage this does. 19 damage, holy crap. Are you impressed? A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Uh we don't have to get fancy here, but I do want to actually defend. Because he's gonna I think he's gonna take a, a, a big hit, big hit from this guy here with the uh, the combo token. I should have smoke screened him. It's okay. It's fine. Do we wanna yeah. Let's make him take a little more damage. He won't get a turn. Yeah! Perfect. The work continues. You'd love to see it. Uh some good items actually. This whiskey barrel is pretty great. Turn start 15% for a super defense. That's pretty cool. I think that maybe uh, uh, our weak little Bonnie, perhaps even Dismas should get it. Bariston can give himself. Let's give it to her. Excuse me. She's so fragile that I feel like it would really help her a lot. pile. Oh. Uh, these two want to fight. If we're gonna fight them, then we're gonna we're gonna go for the diva. Every time. I feel pretty good about fighting these guys, honestly, because of just these two are to a front two ranks are like with that super dodge gives us a great advantage starting out I want to take this guy out first if possible yikes that's why that's why I want to take him out first Which I think I should be able to do that. He's got a lot of HP. He's super tanky. 
was... Oh, wow. Great. That was perfect. Some wing and a miss. Uh, let's... No, he wasn't quite at 50%. That's okay. Oh, you love to see that. The quadruple miss. over the kill here. Yep. That was the correct call. Um, for a little, little, little tankiness. Clear out the corpse. in the fire. That's, that's fine, though. Um, I don't think they'll resist the bleed too well. Nice. Good hit. Suffering begins. Oh, I gotta get him to 30%, that's right. I didn't upgrade that skill. I stand by that, though. Eh. Beautiful. chance on him. Yikes. Thankfully she does like pretty decent damage just in attack damage, so I can't be too like upset about it. that messy. No mastery. Two fights and no mastery. That's that's a bummer. Those skill points are very important. The loathing festers. Alright. Moving forward. Alright, ooh, we got some more stuff. Uh, plus 15% damage. Who do I want to have that? Give it to, I'll give it to the Highwayman. I think that's the best the best use of that particular trinket. We'll probably go a little bit longer here. Um, I'm going to try to make it either to the next party wipe or to the next inn. And then I'll probably call it for, for tonight. But I think we, we, we still got some time, though. Don't go anywhere just yet. It's kind of a bummer because I, I was all primed to, to go a little bit longer, but uh, especially because it doesn't seem like we've made tons of progress because <laughs> we really haven't. But it is a roguelite, so I guess I can't be too. I guess I can't be too upset about it. But either way, I'm having a good time. I hope you were having a good time. That's that's the important bit. Um, let's go for the kill here. Miss chance. Uh, I can't really do a ton here. Maybe we'll just get rid of the corpse. 
It also takes care of one of the block tokens. Ah, you know what? Take care of the block tokens the old-fashioned way. Nice dodges. Love it when a plan comes together. Let's let's stand fast. Let's get a little. This guy can't really do much to us. I should just be trying to. Should just be trying to uh, smash him. That would be the smart thing to do. Classic boredom. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Glad you're glad you're having a good time here. I'm glad you're enjoying the content. A breakthrough. And I very much appreciate the support. Thank you very much. Guy's just he's just marching straight up the line here. <clears throat> Great. We're not gonna be able to set it on fire. There we go. I forgot we she had that skill actually. <laughs> just move her right back up. Like I do like having a party that can function no matter what their placement is. I'm doing this like you can see what I'm doing It'll, it just I, f I keep forgetting that like I recently shrunk my camera field of view <laughs> oh I stole his glory thank you for following scavenge what you can and me I'm gonna mess up the name of this mutes 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 quenchy <laughs> I'm so sorry I know I butchered that, but uh, but thank you, thank you very much for the follow. Uh, much appreciate the support. Glad you too are enjoying the content. I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're all here. I hope you're having a good time tonight. But thank you. If you, uh... <laughs> oh, it's my pleasure. How can, uh, on a scale of one to ten, how bad did I butcher your name just now? <laughs> Mute Squanchy. Oh, oh! I just messed up which which the word break. I guess squanch the squanchers, mute squanchy, mule squanchy. Okay. So I wasn't I wasn't too bad off. <laughs> it was pretty bad. Who are we kidding? Um, I don't mind taking a little bit less loot here to save our money. Because if we just overload on loot, we're not gonna have room for it in the stagecoach anyway. <laughs> Oh, Rick and Morty. Oh, I, I haven't watched it in a really long time, actually. I, I watched the first two seasons, and then the third season wasn't out yet, and by the time it came out, I had gotten rid of cable. So <laughs> I wasn't able to watch it easily. Um, six or seven. Six. <laughs> that's how bad it was. <laughs> Squanchy. That's it. Mute, mute Squanchy. I have to... Uh, oh, I can't remember that now. Which... That show was amazing. I, I do love that one. Um, let's see. What do we do here? Uh, I want to take out this guy in the back. Obviously, that's my primary concern. But I think we have some time. So maybe we just take... Let's, uh... Hmm. Let's, let's try to work on this Shaman first, actually, because he's a punk, and I don't much care for him or his face. Alright. That's huge. Taking care of him in the first round is, like, pretty huge. Um... Let's do a little blocking action. The only thing I don't like about not having his retribution skill active is that he can't draw fire because he's not uh, uh, like he does. It, he doesn't get the taunt. It's okay. It's okay. I'm okay with the dodge. All right. So he's moved up to a point where he can be smashed to bits. And I would much prefer that he be smashed to bits than him explode all over the place. 
Should we take out the... No, you know what? Let's activate Repost here. Oh, I've, I've done a bad thing. But that's okay. It's not the worst. But now I've, I've put us in a, in a kind of a precarious position with positioning. I, I did the one thing that this party can't deal with in terms of positioning. Which is to put the, the runaway in the, in the last spot. Ah. So, uh, Muse Quanchi, have you played a lot of uh, Darkest Dungeon 2? And were you as hyped for it as I was? <laughs> I have played a lot of Darkest Dungeon 1. Let's just kill this guy. Perfect. Okay. Um, so whenever whenever I found out that Darkest Dungeon 2 was coming out in a relatively soonish manner, I was very excited. I couldn't wait to get my hands on it. And it hasn't disappointed. I mean, obviously for, uh, you know, I've talked in my previous streams a lot about, uh, oh, he's taking some damage. We're gonna have to like watch that. Maybe we go for a heal here. I think we should. Yes, totally worth it. And he's bleeding. That's okay. Um, but I was, uh, I, I, I wasn't expecting a whole lot. I'll say that much. Um, I haven't, uh, let's command him to get rid of that mischance. Uh, early access and me have never really gotten along. Uh, <laughs> we've, we've had some problems in the past. But um, I had a lot of I have a lot of faith in in this. Uh, whoops, that's not what I wanted. Um, I have a lot of faith in Red Hook Studios, so I felt pretty confident that if they were going to release a game in early access, it would be enjoyable. And uh, it's got it's got its early access problems, but I've really been having a ton of fun with it. I really have. Let's just take away that dodge chance. He missed! I didn't think you could miss with that. No, just a fan. I don't have a gaming PC, so I've been watching on YouTube and Switch. Or on Twitch, rather. <clears throat> oh, that is a... That is a bummer. It doesn't... It, the one good thing is... Um, it doesn't seem... I actually don't... I, I'll have to look and see what the requirements are. Oh, nice. Very good on the on the kill there. Um, find. It doesn't seem to me like it would have huge requirements in terms of resources. Um, I know the original Darkest Dungeon definitely doesn't. <laughs> so any pretty much anybody can play that game. Uh, plus ten percent damage. I kind of want to having a lot of. I I agree. Um, right now it's it's kind of. Uh, like there's there's I see so much potential I see a ton of potential and uh, I know that like even with Darkest Dungeon 1 even after full release they really did so much improvement in terms of like they just always kept working on the game so even after full release I'm sure they'll they'll continue working on it all right so half of my party is going to be mad at the other half I think we're okay to fight these guys, and we're going to do it with a buff and a debuff for sure. Alright, these two love each other now. It's great. They're going to get married. They're going to go off uh, into the lovely sprawl and build a house. It'll be the one house that's not on fire. This is a, this is a good scenario, actually. This I think we're in pretty good shape for this fight <clears throat> he's got some some problems though for sure um, he's got very little in the way of hit points uh, that didn't help but he's not bleeding um, but yeah I'm very excited I was saying on my uh, I think last night uh, when I streamed this I was saying how I, I 
can't wait to be able to see what things look like at launch, at the full launch, and then look back at maybe some of my old YouTube videos of this game when it first came out, and see what the differences are. Like, I compared it to, um, I compared it to when I played Early Access Hades, and then I saw a lot of iterations of that before its full release. And I remember at one point they, were, they had a huge, massive patch. I want to say it was when they introduced Demeter. Um, and the game, like, the, the, the very aesthetics of the game had changed. Like, they changed a lot of, the, like, the uh, little graphical things, um, little details, and it just, it, it enhanced it so much. Um, but it was it was pretty cool to to be part of that and see how like see how things have changed. So I'm kind of coming around on early access, at least for companies that I trust. <laughs> uh, we'll do a double tap on this guy. He's vulnerable. He healed like a jerk. Let's, let's cauterize, why not? Keep him up at full hit points. Don't bleed him again, thank god. Nah, let's do the highway robbery. That was, that was the right call, I think. Smash him. Well, I'm glad I get to be part of that, though. I'm glad I get to be part of uh, your enjoyment of this game. I, f I have a feeling that it'll probably get some multi-platform releases as well. I don't know when that would be, but I can see it coming out on, like, uh, you know, the various... Like, it, it seems like every game gets a Switch port, at the very least. <laughs> I mean, if you can shove Witcher 3 onto a, onto a Nintendo Switch, then this game can fit for sure. <clears throat> Uh, they all want to go into the unknown. Which unknown is it going to be? I think, uh, yeah, we'll go straight ahead, I think. I think that's the way to go. Is there items? Or no. They're just... They're talking about relationships. Onward, while there is still time. Don't pressure me, narrator. Alright, this is good. So, there'll be an assistance encounter. We'll, we'll maybe get a little bit of, uh... A little bit of torch back, but most importantly, we'll get some health back. Facing oblivion, these folks have kept their honor. Have you? Um, if we're going to choose between the exact same benefit and losing 16 or 6 money, we'll lose the 6. And everybody's still happy about it. The spoils, win, win, win. Another whiskey barrel. Power. Wow. Amorous Ballads. Okay. Looks good. I think you're the last one to... Plus four crit, huh? Yeah, you know what? You can have... I think that'll be fun. The Move Resist. I don't think anybody really needs. Just, it, yeah. It doesn't matter for this party makeup. I don't think, anyway. Alright, another, uh... Another resistance encounter ahead. But it looks like we did get pretty, pretty good, uh... Pretty good on the heels here, between fights. Another burning pile. Let's see if these guys even want to fight. They do, and they're gonna argue about it, too. I think we can kill them. No! Oh yeah, no, that, okay. For a second, I thought I picked run. Uh, I'm surprised. We haven't really seen... I mean, for these resistance encounters, like, they haven't really done... They haven't really thrown at me what they can. Because some of these fights can be pretty brutal.
I think we will continue to focus fire on this guy in the third rank here. What? What? A flare? Is that his name? No, that's the flare. Slow suffering begins. God, these guys are creepy looking. Did you ever just take a moment and just admire the aesthetics? The immolatist. That's who I was thinking of. There's all these little details that I'm finding even this far into it. I haven't... Uh, there's still much more to be had, I'm sure, with this game as far as future patches and updates. But it's all the little things that like, uh, sometimes I just gotta take a moment and look at. Wow, are you buffed. Okay, okay. We get it. We're gonna bump on this guy up front. Because he's making mad. Uh We will hex him. We will rob him. And all your buffs are gone. If I can ask one thing of you, Immolatist, it would be to not heal. And please just accept your fate. Wow. Super buffed again. A good repost. Very good repost. You know what? Go for the heal. Yeah, or go for the kill, rather. <laughs> Always go for the heal or the kill, I guess. I think we can focus fire on this guy a little bit and maybe not get our butts kicked by Repost. Wow. Alright, thanks for the massive heal. We haven't had to really deal with stress too much at all, which has been very nice. advanced here advanced duelist um, and we can rob him again good oh he kept the repost that is highly unfortunate Steady yourself. yikes of course he would crit on that guy we're gonna just we're gonna bolster and get his get his stress right back down where it belongs which is below five. She's blind. Can we... Maybe we just focus on killing this guy. Instead of trying to be all fancy. Perfect. You know what heals burn and bleed very well? No game Ending the fight. Oh, and bandages. Thank God we got some bandages. Do we have anyone we can equip that on? I mean, sure. I would much... Oh, we have two sets of bandages. Okay. We got a large heal there. What are these? Neutralizing powders? We don't got to worry about those. We'll equip. I'd rather have the things that heal it then prevent it because the prevention seems to never really do anything to help us um all right i think we should go to the hero shrine who still needs skills unlocked the 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 runaway and the occultist mm. i think it's worth it Although, a couple of my dudes are getting a little stressed out here. It's okay. I think we can... I think we can manage that pretty well. She searches the dying world for the keys to her own salvation. Uh, oh no, the Antiquarian's here! Ooh, fun! She 
She's got some hit points too. I don't remember her being so beefy in Darkest Dungeon 1. I think it's pretty neat that the Antiquarian is not actually a playable class, but an enemy. That's a neat touch. Not when she does that, but uh, I mean, what are you going to do? Should we focus fire on her? No, she's being guarded. Who's guarding her? I don't remember. I didn't see. There is comfort in company. She also looks super cool. I, I really like her design in this game as well. I think it's pretty awesome. Lethality writ large. I wouldn't mind her being a playable character though, for sure. I, I, I gotta wonder, <laughs> the Flagellant and the Houndmaster. Yeah, we were talking about that earlier, actually. Uh, the Houndmaster was probably one of my favorite classes in Darkest Dungeon 1. And the Flagellant is also one of my favorite classes in Darkest Dungeon 1. So seeing both of those guys would be pretty cool uh, in this game. Also, an Arbalist might be kind of neat. Some kind of like focused range, a little bit of heal. I, I do wonder if, uh, if Vestal is on, the, uh, is on the agenda. I'm thinking probably not. I don't know how that would work in this style of game. But I would love to see a Vestal. Sometimes that would be really helpful. <laughs> oh, dodges! So many dodges! Alright, one down. At least this is not a timed battle. Thank goodness for that. Do we command here, or do we go for a hit? Let's go for the let's let's go for the recurring blocks. It's okay. We use a bandage. We have a bunch of them. Uh. And then I think we gotta just try to start smashing these dudes, huh? You know what? You want to defend? We can defend. We can we can do that too, huh? Nice heal. I'll take it. Nice head. I think I'll take it. Ugh. I would love, <laughs> I honestly would really like to have, uh, have the Antiquarian in my party. <laughs> Miscalculation, perhaps. That highway robbery is really doing great things for us in this fight. Oh, quit it. Clear those tokens, because we need to, like, kill a dude. Why are you stunned? I didn't agree to that. Best character in DD2 so far. Um... I'm going to go with, I think if, if I had to pick, I mean, there's so many that are good. I, I, it's a toss up for me. Um, I really like all of the characters in their own capacity. I, I think the Jester is probably my favorite character, uh, in, in Darkest Dungeon 2. Um, I think he's just way too good. Uh, the Man at Arms is also become a very necessary part of every run <laughs> so really the two of them 
are are probably among the top two. But if I had to pick one of them, I would say the Jester. Um, he, the Jester has a very good stress heal, um, as well as just an unbelievable um, uh, a couple of skills that uh, like will. Um, not only kind of move him around in the ranks, but also uh, inflict debuffs on the enemy while buffing himself. He's f and his crit chance is really high. Um, well, I should say much higher than most of the other other characters, and it's he just ends up being ridiculously powerful. Uh, yeah, we'll get rid of some tokens and some corpses. But I really think, I think that there's definitely a lot of, uh, a lot of value to almost every, there's no class that I can say that I really don't want to explore more. Steady yourself. They're, they're all pretty cool. The only one that's kind of disappointing to me, if I had to pick one that was disappointing overall, I would say it's the Hellion. Because the Hellion was definitely one of my favorites um, in the first game, for sure. Nice. All right. She's she's mine. She's all mine now. I wish I could capture her. I don't think. Oh, yeah. I messed up my 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 icons. That's okay. Get rid of that dodge. I almost feel bad for this poor girl now. I mean, they make you kill her whole party, and then she's just by herself, all defenseless. <laughs> um, but in terms of the Hellion, I'm not a big fan of her like special little quirk, which is that she gets winded after some of her better abilities. And it's meant to like kind of mimic the debuffs from the first one, but for some reason they feel way worse in this game because she already doesn't do that much damage to begin with. I'm sorry for the pops. I can hear them. I can hear them in my headphones. I know I'm like every time I breathe heavily, I'm like I'm popping the mic. I'm sorry if that's annoying. <laughs> uh, ooh, combat starts. Crit chance, fifteen percent. That's a pretty cool trinket, actually. You should get that. Definitely the Highwayman. He's getting all the cool stuff today. All right. So that battle took forever, but it actually went pretty well. Um, who still needs, you know what? <sighs> I like the Jester's character design. I, yeah, I, I think, uh, he, I mean, they all look super cool, but there, there is something, there's just something a little extra about the Jester, even just in terms of not even the way he looks, but the, the his movement and the way he like spins around uh, when he moves ranks and stuff. Like it's it's just they put a lot of work into him. You can tell. Let's go with the occultist here. Chapter four. The guest. The guest. Oh, it's a it's a playable encounter. Oh no. Really? Drawing vitality from the assembled mediums, he would hold fast against the thing. It's a dimensional a shambler. Portion of its power. All right, what do we got here? Self, negative token, allies remove negative token. What? All right, so he gives himself a combo token and then removes it from his allies. Oh, this, these are my allies here. Okay, we're doing a seance. I like these encounters as well, too, because you see them outside of their normal garb, and you kind of see them from the past, which is kind of neat. Um, let's see. Weakening Curse. That seems important. Inner Strength. Extra Action. 
target three stress. I can stress out the Shambler? Is that what I'm being led to believe here? Cool down one, heal 20%, remove. So, oh boy. The Burning Stars condition blocked requires self two more. Okay, all right. I think I get it. So let's, do we summon? Oh, so I have no way to heal stress though. Uh, what are your other people? Uh, ooh, can I target them? They take a lot of stress though. I don't wanna, <laughs> I'm afraid to do it. Um, all right, so we can't, we don't wanna use that yet because nobody has any tokens. Um, I know I should do something, huh? Let's weaken him. <laughs> we did it. Ouch. Alright, so we can heal that. Target gets stressed out for three, though. Is that is that correct? Who's getting targeted? Are we stressing out the Shambler? Is that, is that our goal? You know what? Let's, let's just try this. Okay, so we can't, like, stress them out too hard, right? Heal. 20. Extra action. That's on cooldown. Okay. So heal the bleed, I guess. This wound at least has been tended we're gonna, like, we're gonna totally stress ourselves out here. We're gonna, we're gonna just go straight for the stars. Do it. It was totally, it was all, it was, none of it was worth it. <laughs> oh, interesting. So, now what do we do? Um, I guess we should do that, a shifting boundary, and have it. All right, they're healing stress like once per turn, which is pretty cool. I can I can deal with that. Um, so do we do do we have enough? So if this is like a weird kind of thing. I gotta wait for all the stress to come back down. All right, so can we? We'll do this again. I think I have this relatively figured out. So I have to I have to do it one more time because if I is no as long as I don't heal, we should be okay, right? If my math checks out, it does not check out. Can I Resist it. That's unfortunate. Okay, this is fine. This works out okay. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. This. This is what I want. Why isn't the Shambler always this easy? Oh, that was some damage. That was some damage for sure. Uh, so let's heal. We'll take the extra action. Get a little bit of uh, cushiony HP there. Uh, we will get our extra action again. We're up to two of the unchecked powers. Did we burn him? We burned him with stars. Ooh. Okay. This is pretty cool. I'm enjoying this fight, actually. Uh, should we heal again? Yeah, and then we'll we'll kind of cool it with the with the stress for a minute. Oh, we get an extra. We get an extra action. Don't consume me. We resist the bleed. That's good. That's very good news. Uh. All right, just keep an eye on the stress. Yeah, we gotta we gotta cool it a little bit. 
We killed it. Imbued with strange the burning stars ignores defense. Eight to ten. Wow. It requires self. Uh, two unchecked powers and the target will get a combo token. Yeah, that was a that. I mean, the gimmick was. Uh, I thought that was just a cool cinematic battle. It was easy to figure out. I wish they were all that easy to figure out. I've had some trouble with the with some of them. Mostly the grave robber one. There's the 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 nightcap grave robber one. That that one messed me up for. I had to do that one like seven times, and I could not figure out <laughs> what the heck I was doing wrong. Uh, so, we... Right now, this has a chance to increase, so we'll keep that skill the way it is. Do I want to try to make this work, is the question. Um, and then what do I give up? To have it. I don't want to give up the vulnerability hex. It's just too good. Maybe abyssal artillery. We're not really using it all that much. Although I think that will help us later. Uh, we'll have to see what it does when it gets upgraded. I can't remember. Um, Let's try it. Let's let's we'll ditch the abyssal artillery for now and, and uh, equip burning stars. We'll see how much. I very rarely actually see um, see him see him get to two of those tokens. All right, we got a hoarder coming up. I think we have like tons of money too, so we'll see if there's anything. He never has anything good. Oh, excuse me. He struggles to decide what is real, holding back fits of. All right, death. so more bandages. Um, uh, let's see. Medium fire attack. That's pretty neat. These are okay, but I'm not going to spend six gold on one of them. We have 44 gold. Uh, I definitely think we should get some playing cards. A bit of comfort on the road to damnation. My time in the desert. I mean, that's a pretty cool, pretty cool thing to have. Mop and bucket. Boxing gloves, nothing else really good. Well, we'll take the pipe weed. Something to ease the rigors of the road. Increase speed, nah. I have to get rid of something if I want to buy that, so we can get rid of this stuff. I, I never use them. And then yeah, we'll buy we'll buy a book, my time in the desert. Any any decent trinkets? Stagecoach. We got, do we have any stagecoach items? We do not. We don't have enough money anymore either. They're too expensive anyway. <laughs> that would be pretty cool. 50% chance to, to start with a taunt. I don't think any of these are really going to be worth it. Range attacks... Plus 20%. Might be okay. It might be good to get that for him. But I'm kind of okay with what he has. Yeah. I don't feel like... Well, no, this actually... Combat start... Heck yeah. Actually, we will buy that. Alright. So who gets it is the question. Seems like something Barristan should have. Oh my god, you're not getting along with anybody. That's a bummer. <clears throat> we can give this to you, I think. Yeah. If we can get like everybody to start with a huge like defensive buff, <laughs> that'll make things a heck of a lot easier for us. Right. 
looks like we gotta we gotta do a little stress healing here on on Alahaz Red. Ooh, this is gonna be a tough fight to do that with. Did we get shuffled? I missed it. I'm going to immediately try to blind your butt. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. Um, move him up just yet. I want to get him into a better position here. I don't want the the runaway to get stuck in the back. Let's let's start with some buffs here, actually, because I, I really uh, this guy's going to be a problem. The howler. Gross. That that's bad news. I should have bolstered. That would have been the smart thing to do. Nice. Thank me later, sweet thing. Miscalculation, perhaps. Ouch. Ooh, bad news. Bad news. You're like super stressed out now. Should we just let's just use this? A little help, impeccable. I don't want to fall too far behind. You're dead, so let's attack you. We'll never see it. It's 50% chance he gets one of those tokens. We'll never see it. We need to bolster. I was going to go for the damage, but especially with him being super stressed or er, uh, having the horror. That's really making things much worse. Take away his doge. Ah, he resisted that again. That is unfortunate. Stumbling and still. Oh. The stress is getting scary. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Alright. So, zero out of two times. For that. Uh, who gets it this time? I think you need it. You need the stress heal. So I think we should definitely consider upgrading the bolster ability uh, the first chance we get. Final round! It's okay, we'll kick his butt. Especially without a dodge. Oh, he's just gonna put it back on. Yep, there it is. Son of a gun. Thankfully, we broke through that dodge. Very good. Very good stuff. Now nah, we'll use a bandage this time. Then we'll use the cauterize. Come on, give me the death blow. Give it to me. No! You jerk. Well, alright, it could have gone worse. We probably wouldn't have got much for that fight anyway. Although I'm a little worried about uh, our occultist stress level. Although we're, we're getting pretty close to it in. Let us hope their desperation can be eased. Uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll take the option that everybody wants. I'm happy with that. Wealth is worthless without purpose. All right, what do we start? We gotta start getting rid of stuff. Perfect, done, easy. All right, we're close to the end here. Ooh, I think we should. We must uh, keep moving. I think we go straight ahead. They want to go to the to the unknown, but I I would rather. Uh, make sure we can heal properly before we get to the Guardian encounter. We don't have any, um... One mastery! That's it! 
that can't go on. We they, they have to. They with their most recent patch, they reduced pretty heavily the amount of skill points you get from, or rather, the, I guess the chance to get skill points uh, from fights. And um, it, ha I mean, it's it's. I don't know if they lowered it more or what, but it's it, they're killing me. An elementary problem, is it not? Um, what's a telescope? What does that mean? That's like clearly some kind of trinket and some stress and a quirk, and that all looks very scary. Uh, I don't know what the telescope means though. Then this guy, he just wants to go. He's just like, ah. Eh. Let's, let's see what the telescope is. All right, they all hate each other. Oh no, these guys, they had a meltdown? Who had a meltdown? <laughs> oh, it's, it's all going to heck right now. <laughs> oh, you see how easy it can turn on you? It can turn real quick. Oh my God. He hates everybody, and he's at five hit points. Uh, so what? What was? What did we get? Did we get anything for that? No, we just got stressed out. What? What does the telescope mean? Um, is I mean, that, is that really what we got? Is this it? This trinket? Plus 25% move resist. Alright. Now we can go to the unknown because we're definitely not fighting cultists now. Hope everybody's okay with that. Oh, it's another academic study. <laughs> huh. I like the way you tetherball, sir. Okay, so we'll be like okay going into the. Full of the forbidden. All right, the uh, we have the chance to just run this time. We should take it. <laughs> uh, okay, we got a guardian encounter. We're just five leagues from the inn. This moss is hanging on. I mean, we're all getting pretty stressed out now because now, like. Everyone hates the occultist. It's uh, NBC's newest sitcom. Everybody hates Ella Hazred. All right. I definitely don't see us going the distance in terms of making it through all three of these levels. We're going to go ahead and just pop one of these glimmers here to get our our, uh, our torch drained really quick. I feel like we had a bunch of flame encounters and they, they all went away. That's okay, though. Alright, either way, that was a win for us. Um, I want that shaman to be dead. Because he does the heals, and the heals are no good. Oh, did we get one of those tokens? Very good. Now, it's so funny. Now every, all of a sudden everybody likes him. I thought all his relationships were bad. Die. <laughs> okay. Let's let's definitely do that. Get rid of those block tokens. I should have bolstered. What am I thinking? Now I'm gonna lose the opportunity. Oh no, he's he's not taking the stress. I'll heal him for one one whole stress. I'll run away and never come back. You know, at this point I feel like that can only help.
Lovely dodge. Yeah. Come on. Ah, I want to see. I want to see this new ability. Boy, she's way in the back now. That's fine. Um, we can't bolster. Let's just try to make sure we don't explode. That's really my primary concern at the moment. Good. Primary concern has been resolved. You're too far ahead. Weird sound glitch just now. Oh, total glitch. What the heck happened there? It just like straight up ignored. It's like it's like it didn't happen. Very weird. We'll call that a bug. Begins. That's an early access bug. Uh, oh, we can, yeah, we can. We'll do this all day. Why won't the dodge go away? Oh, he's about to have a meltdown, too. It's going to go very badly for everybody very soon. Don't look at me, it's not my fault. Stop whining. Just kill a dude. Okay, we did not get another one of those tokens. Not that we'd be able to use the ability in it anyway, because he's way out of position. And he's now at death's door. And I spilled my juice. And I stubbed my toe. What else? I got an eyelash in my eye. <laughs> Just pick whatever. Burn bright, my darling. Hey, thanks for the heals. You're like super out of position now. I guess she should probably focus on like not being that far out of position. Ah. Uh. Whatever. How far? You can move back too. What? What? What just happened? Did I hit the? I had the wrong guy selected. It's fine. It's all fine. This wound, at least, has been tended to. Very cool. Uh, we will escape. <laughs> That's a kind of a no-brainer. We, 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 I mean, we probably could have taken on the second fight, but I mean, why bother? Because you don't get anything for it. I mean, you get like a little bit of loot, but uh, the, the thing that really counts is right there is mastery. Um, and you don't get any if you don't beat the entire thing. I feel like... I feel like I should not have been able to make it through an entire area and have as many fights as we did and only get one skill point. That is kind of upsetting. But it's, you know, it is what it is. I think that they, they want you to not rely on skill upgrades, and I get that. Because really, if you have too many, it can get pretty crazy. But, I mean... I feel like if you get a bunch of them, you've earned them, you know? All right. Whew. We've made it to an end. It took us long enough. I feel like... <laughs> I feel like we spent a lot of time making zero progress. Uh, we did get our um, side quest completed. I had completely forgotten about it. I'll be honest. I don't even remember what it was. We got 250 hope for that. All right. 
Well, I think that that's going to do it for tonight. Um, I'm not going to do anything here at the end because if I close the game, it's just going to, it's not going to save anything that I do. So we'll work on a little bit more of that next time. Um, all right. So let's see here. Genie, what a guy. Thank you for the raid, man. I appreciate it. All the raiders that came over from Genie Stream, welcome. Hope you enjoyed what you saw. I really appreciate you get pre. Let's try that again. I really appreciate you guys hanging out, and I hope you enjoyed the stream. Uh, classic boredom, and I'm gonna. It, it, it has been several minutes since I've pronounced your name the last time, so I'm gonna screw it up again. <laughs> Mute Squanchy. Mute Squanchy. I believe that that was correct. <laughs> Classic Boredom and Mute Squanchy, thank you so much for the follows. I appreciate you guys hanging out and chatting for a while. Um, I Again, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. I enjoyed having you guys here. Um, I had a lot of fun tonight. I hope everyone had a great time. Um, let me see who is streaming. I think I would like to maybe send a raid over to a friend of mine named Railfunk. I know it's going to be a, a kind of a different... Uh, Definitely a different vibe um, <laughs> than, uh, oh, I lost my OBS. There it is. It's right there. I lost my OBS. But um, he's a he, he's a, he's a good dude. Um, but it's definitely, he plays uh, Call of Duty. So it's kind of a different, obviously. Or no, he's playing Battlefield. He's playing Battlefield 2042 right now. But he's a good time. Um, so I'll send you guys over to him. Um so I encourage you to give him a, a check him out, see if uh, see if he's up your alley or not. Um, and again, thank you all so much for joining me tonight. And I hope to see you all again very soon. And that's it. That's it for me. Have a great night, everybody.